frustration over unemployment in Pennsylvania. State lawmakers took the man in charge to task over how long many people have had to wait to get their money. Channel 11's Mike Holden is live in Pittsburgh this morning. Mike, there was a joint hearing to talk about this, and it got heated. Catherine, we have heard from one person after the next that filing for unemployment has been a total nightmare, a disaster when it comes to trying to get in touch with someone over the phone, trying to get the website to actually load. These state lawmakers say enough is enough. A, t a change has to happen now, and this has to be for the greater good of everyone, specifically these Pennsylvanians who are struggling each and every day. Now, two Pennsylvania Senate committees held a meeting yesterday to talk about the issues plaguing the unemployment system. They questioned the Department of Labor and Industry Secretary. The secretary said there has been a record 1.7 million claims, and staffing had previously been slashed because of prior low unemployment numbers. He also said the unemployment office's computer system is 40 years old. It is the set to be upgraded this fall. Now, at times, this meeting was very heated and tense, with senators demanding an immediate fix. The Department of Labor and Industry confirms there are now 900 people taking calls and helping people file their claims. However, state lawmakers say it's a little too late. Who will be held accountable and in what way so that at least the unemployed Pennsylvanians still waiting for a payment can know their current suffering will lead to a better functioning department in the future? I will be held accountable and we are fully ready to do what we need to do to meet the needs of our citizens. Am I frustrated? Yes, I am frustrated. I told you I have family members who are waiting. I have relatives that are. I get it. We get it. The Department of Labor and Industry Secretary says roughly 70% of the people who filed for unemployment have received their checks. However, we are still getting emails and Facebook messages from local folks who say that is not the case. So we're working to talk with them in the hours ahead. I'll bring you new updates for Channel 11 News at noon and 5 o'clock. And if you have any concerns on how to file or you need additional resources, just head over to WPXI.com. Reporting live this morning from the North Shore, Mike Holden, Channel 11 News.